Alexa family. It's your girl African Export from AfricanExportsBlog.com. You may have seen the post. I said I was Mac Holland. I went to Mac Cosmetics a counter to pick up some lipsticks. Now, I love me some lipsticks. So I know for a lot of you guys, finding shades that work for you, finding nudes, finding colors that are complimentary sometimes can be difficult so I just wanted to share that with you I have pictures on my blog but I did not swatch them on my face so that's what this video will be about air finishes there's lusters there's glazes there's frost there's satins there's mattes you don't like in your face opaque meaning no see-through you're not gonna see the the pigmentation in your lips then you're going to love the matte or satin luster is very very moisturizing I like to use those without a moisturizer okay um, I'm just giving you guys some 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 background if you're not familiar some of y'all probably already know like get to the video girl okay let's just see the colors okay this is oh it's a frost finish it is a bronzy uh, shade with a little bit of burgundy throughout it's a beautiful everyday color it is brown girl friendly it's usually a color that gets recommended to us brown girls if you go to the counter so this is a beautiful beautiful shade I actually was apprehensive of picking it up but once I tried it on I really really liked it so syrup is a luster finish it's a pretty kind of a mauve pink with a little bit of brown it's a brownish color pink it is really really nice on luster so it does show the pigmentation of your lips so if you do have highly pigmented lips this is going to be a really soft pink on you this is cherish um, this is a satin finish it's kind of a uh, I'm gonna say it's an orangey nude shade this is a nice nude for deeper complexions and it is great paired with a chocolate colored lip liner this is spirit this is also a really nice nude color um, with a kind of brown undertone to it nice nude for deeper complexions it's also a beautiful color on um, tan and deeper skin tones this is one of my all-time favorites this is icon also a frost it is a taupey brown shade and I think on the website it says there's some purple or violet throughout um, it will look different on everyone it's perfect for cool skin tones if you have a cool skin tone um, you will probably look nice in this it can come off very very gray on the wrong skin tone but on myself it's a gorgeous color which I absolutely love so Ruby Woo blue based true red popular colors that works for everybody i've been told there's a dupe there's a dupe there's a dupe there's no dupe for this color that i have found um i've been told max or excuse me i've been told revlon's really red is a dupe i have here on my hand uh swatches excuse me swatches this one closest to me this is ruby woo and next to it is revlon's really red matte and then next to that is Wet n Wild's 911D. So as you can see, Max Ruby Woo is a true red, really red matte by Revlon is a little bit more orange based. So if you really want Ruby Woo, go ahead and get Ruby Woo. go Ruby Woo very pretty universal color all right family so hopefully you enjoyed that quick video with the lipstick swatches if you missed the blog post I'll post the link for it down below and thank you guys for watching the video let me know if there are some other shades that you're interested in me possibly swatching I may have them in my collection here so I do have um, a lot of shades that I did not showcase in this video. So hopefully you guys are doing well. I'll talk to you guys in the next video. Keep it real until next time. Bye. Hugs. Mm.